My name is Alessandro Posati. I am director of the Zweka Project Space. Uh, we are showing Atelier van Lieshout Slave City in occasion of the Venice Architecture Biennio. The exhibition uh, is a dystopic, utopian, zero footprint urban plan uh, of a city. It's a realistic model of a living space uh, calculated uh, to the finest detail uh, in terms of uh, its economics of how 200,000 people or slaves uh, would uh, function. Uh, the artist uh, set out to develop the project by first and foremost creating an extensive uh, business plan and the fruit of the business plan is a profit and loss sheet from which all the artworks originate. So extensive calculations have led to the creation of a city uh, with a zero footprint where no one person has gone to waste. Of course, the one thing that is removed from the equation is any moral, ethics, or religious um, consideration towards the human being. The human being is, is used uh, and consumed in a purely functional and utilitarian way. So the human being in this equation is a pure uh, function and purely uh, serves a s simple purpose. Everybody serves a purpose and everybody feeds the greater purpose, which is uh, to provide a profit for the owner of the city. The exhibition is composed of different living modules uh, where functions of the city are adempt. Uh, slaves are not paid in money, but they're paid in favors. And f the only favors you can have in slave city are sexual favors. Uh, sexual favors are consumed in brothels. And so there are many different categories of brothels where one may consume his favors, be they low class or triple A prime class. This dystopic view of society and civilization seems extreme at moments, but if we do look around our world uh, at some uh, not so far off corners, we realize that it's a reality much closer than we think. Um, the themes that are touched upon by the artist uh, involve all of us from the minute we walk into a H&M or into a Walmart. The idea of bringing Slave City into the architecture biennial uh, by inviting a contemporary artist is the view of a contemporary artist onto what urban planning, urban management, and how the development of urban structures in relationship to society is an invitation to the architecture community to uh, consider the possibilities uh, and how many structures that they create uh, do in fact end up uh, serving uh, functions others than were expected. So um, it is a controversial exhibition, uh, certainly, and uh, no one has uh, yet to have, uh, put it into close proximity to actual real architecture. But in fact, uh, an artist's imagination and this topic creation very much comes in discourse and dialogue to what uh, the world of architecture does produce in reality and that we have to deal with in our daily lives.
Vika Project Space exists since 2011. We are a non-for-profit uh, cultural organization involved in the curation and production of uh, cultural and art projects, primarily around the uh, different biennials, meaning contemporary art, architecture, film. Um, we work out of collaboration between artists, curators, uh, galleries, foundations, museums, and uh, the private sector whenever it's possible. Uh, we believe that uh, the cultural message which uh, we help to develop is essentially um, the most meaningful uh, part of the discourse we can bring uh, to the cultural uh, international community.